friends welcome to my workplace at ranaghat west bengal india in this video i want to demonstrate the divide and conquer technique of fecal emulsification and i have shown the technique at slow motion at 70% of real speed by this time after the initial steps hydro dissection has been done the nucleus has been rotated and now the tip of the fecal handpiece is being introduced and from here you are going to see the surgery in slow motion enter into the anterior chamber bevel down remove some superficial cortical matter and then turn the tip with the help of your left hand so that the bevel is up introduce the chopper again and now make a trench the trench should be through the center of the nucleus and it should be a straight line but in this case it was not straight and always use ultrasonic energy when you are going forward when you are coming backwards stop using ultrasonic energy be in continuous irrigation so that if you remove your foot switch the chamber is maintained when you are making the trenches the vacuum is very low say 50 to 60 mm of mercury flow rate is also low 20 to 25 ml per minute and arsenic power is according to the density of the cataract in this case it was 50% this is a cataract with grade 3 nucleus sclerosis now you should go really deep into the anterior chamber to sufficient depth at least 75% depth you should go the 2.8 mm deep should be sinking in the group and now you can see some faint red glow at the floor of the trench the trench should be of equal depth all around there should not be any ridges on the path of the trench if it is there just shave it off and then crack by applying opposite forces and see how to engage this and use your chopper to crack this If you don't find it comfortable, you can come out, inject visco, and use two instruments, like two choppers or two sinski hooks, to crack this. But it is recommended that you learn to crack without coming out with your fecal teeth and the chopper. Learn to crack, and now, after you have divided the nuclear. nucleus into some fragments go to fecal to mode where the vacuum is higher in this case i am using 400 vacuum you can use little less vacuum and whatever vacuum is recommended by your senior in your machine the machine being used here in this case is otley catrix 3 and just if it is a bigger piece learn to hold the piece and chop it into smaller pieces as you learn to hold later on you can hold the whole nucleus and you not need not make trench you can just chop it into fragments and emulsify the fragments that's it the nucleus is nicely managed and now come out Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills. 
be a great surgeon and serve the mankind with love, respect, compassion and great surgical competence. This video is being dedicated to my student Alexander Jeptik from Serbia.